As you can see, I have a working washer, but uh, before I fixed it, it was just sitting here on sensing and wouldn't add water, wouldn't do anything. It just sit there and make a few noises and never, uh, never get past that part. So what I figured out, it was this uh, water inlet part here. You have uh, two solenoids. So when you gain access to it by taking this screw out here in the middle, and then there's one over here and one on this side to get this to pull out so you can access the bottom of it where this is sitting. Um, I believe it's sitting in there like this. And uh, let's see if that's right. You have hot water. And then there's two torques that will be kind of in this area that go in here. Two torque screws you'll take out. And then you can pull that out. Um, this part here when I ordered it was 25 on Amazon, but I'll put a link in the description. But uh, all I had to do was take this connector out of the old one and put this in because these are already connected to this. So it's not a bad fix um, if you're handy at all. It's worth trying because it's a lot cheaper than hiring somebody else to fix it. But uh, after putting that part in, it worked. Um, you do need to test this to know if this is the issue by putting a multimeter tool on these two prongs here and then test this side as well. And if you're not getting any resistance on either one, uh, this is the problem. So hopefully this will be helpful for you to uh, fix your washer.